Welcome. In this video, we will walk through the steps to set up your Rockwell PLC hardware in Logix Designer. We will be using a Rockwell Compact Logix PLC, also referred to as a programmable logic controller, and using Studio 5000 Logix Designer programming software. The steps outlined may vary slightly based on the hardware being used. Navigate to Logix Designer. Logix Designer is part of the Studio 5000 Rockwell software package. Open the software and select Create a New Project. The New Project window displays. Select your PLC from the list. Name your project and click the Next button. Select zero modules from the Expansion I.O. drop-down box. Click the Finish button. This creates a blank project with the correct hardware definition in your controller organizer. Open the Communications menu and select Who Active from the list. Select the correct path to your PLC. The New Project Settings dialog displays. Select the driver that you configured and drill down to your PLC. Click the Set Project Path button with your PLC selected. Next, click the Download button. A warnings box will display. Click the Download button again. Then click the Yes button to change the controller mode back to Remote Run. You should now be online and the I.O. OK light should show green. Click on the Remote Run setting and select Go Offline in the drop-down list. You are now offline. Right-click on Ethernet in the Controller Organizer pane and select New Module from the option list to create a new module. The Select Module window displays. Check the Cognix Corporation checkbox under Module Type Vendor Filters. Filter through the Cognix devices and select your device in the Module Type list. In this example, I am searching for my InSight 2800 sensor. Note, if you have added the Cognix add-on profile, there will be a list of Cognix devices displayed. Click the Create button. The new module window displays. Enter the name and IP address of your device in the appropriate fields. It is important that you make note of the name because you will be using it in future steps of the process. Once complete, click the Finish button. Your hardware is now set up and ready to use. For more information, check out the other videos in the Connecting to the Rockwell PLC series. Thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you.